I have been robbed down here in Dallas. I'm not Dallas, Houston, Texas. No, See, I don't even know where I am. I don't even know where I am. <laughs> I have been robbed. I got no more stuff in my folder, bro. They got me. <laughs> they got me. <laughs> somebody, uh, can somebody be responsible for making a copy of this? I got you. Okay, because I want everybody to have one. Well, I might as well give, give these other two. Yeah, might as well. We can hold down for now. Oh, boy. Rough crap, rough crap. We like it when the Rob, when the Rob just give up this stuff easily. Yeah, yeah. You know, he was just fighting to get Easy take. Easy take. I'm just wondering, so this was this the only sample we're gonna have of one that you actually did. We don't have this is our only sample one that you've done, so that when you leave here one that you have. Oh no. We might have time to do another one. Gonna do another one? Hopefully we'll have plenty of chance to do another one. See, you know, uh, when you go and as you look in museums <coughs> At these types of stale, I guarantee you, I'll bet my life on it. But I'm, I'll do it anyway because I come back and take my life in my hands. <laughs> anyway, I'll bet my life on it. When you go in the museum, if you learn this formula, you can read 90% of the stale like this. I guarantee it. Because they all follow the same thing. Uh, first, you have the offering. This is the offering. The offering that the king gives to the god. And then it tells what the offering is. And then it's passed on to the cop of the person. Yeah, what it's just a... Huh? Go ahead. Uh, it's it's the the yeah, I know you said it wasn't the soul. What right. The car is, is your essence. It's your... What animates you. Oh, okay. This is what remains. Uh, after you get... Uh, yeah, the car, yeah. The car is, comes into existence when you come into existence. Right. And when you die, the car doesn't die. The car goes, it remains. Because uh, even in, in the Epirmid text, it says, uh, they speak of, you know, a person going to their car. The car remains, yeah. It's energy, the force. You know. <laughs> the soul comes into existence after death, and then there's the shade, or the shadow. Yeah. yeah. And the, the uh, destiny is a glorious outcome. What's the shadow call? Huh? What's the shadow call? How come you can't take your car with you? Huh? How come you can't take your car with you? I don't know. Isn't that what the funeral service is supposed to help you do, to take your car with you? No, the bar. You want the bar to come back. See, the bar, uh, the bar is the one who goes back and forth to any place it desires and it does business and stuff on earth. Yeah, I understand. But I'm talking about, I'm talking about the car. Yeah, well, I mean, I, you, you know, take, in I mean, essence, you said, Take everything. <laughs> well, you wanted the car to die too. <laughs> but see, the car when you die, the, the, the car remains with the body there in the uh, in the tomb. But that's what I'm saying. Why can't you take the car with you? You do. It goes in the tomb because the car, uh, is, the tomb is the house of the car. Really? When you look at it, you know, because all, every time you go and do an offering, and you do this whole tep and the sue offering is always in the car in for the car of this person. And and, and the uh, false door, they come through the door to receive the offerings that, that, that you give. Yeah, you know, when you go there and you see this false door, that's the door that, you know, especially the sun. I'm not, this is just, what it was. yeah, especially the sun, you know, you want the sun to uh, do the offering. And so what is the, what is the best thing the sun can do for the Father? You all know? What is the best thing that a son can do for your for your father? Bury him. Avenge the offerings. I mean, avenge the wrongs that was done to my father. It's the best thing I can do. Like him. Like mm -hmm. him. Yeah. You got it. And also, uh, uh, that uh, Ujit, that protection, you know, when he, he uh, uh, he, uh, uh, 
provided that protection for his father that that became bread and beer so all of the offerings that you give now in essence can be considered uh, the ujit the ujit I also represents offerings you know that, that, that sustains the soul of the car not the soul of the car of course that is that a that word which one T or MR which one line three yeah MR. MR? Yeah. Y'all sure down to make a brother feel good, though. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, uh, um, what, what a brother would think that the Marlon. Greatest model to come on. Excuse me. Wait, 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 where the cabbage? Oh. That was Chris. <laughs> Man, what kind of brother is that? That was Chris. That wasn't Marlon. Chris, brother, 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 you know, I'm speaking this, you know, he had me to get Okay, let me, let me, let me, let me um, show you all where this, uh, this IPA goes. Under the first one, I think, was, was the, uh, yeah. Under the first symbol on that page should be MSW. Right here, the suit. MSW hyphen under this one should go hotel hyphen bi diesel. Oh, that's what you're saying, right? Huh? This doesn't relate to that. Yeah, that's what this is. But you know what, what I'm trying to you know show you is see right there. See, see hotel right there. Right. Then the suit. Uh oh, you'll be. Uh -huh, begin again, please. So, uh, okay, all right, let me, let me try again. Try to see what this symbol uh, is Nisu. Okay? That one symbol. Right, uh huh. Okay. Right now, don't write anything yet. This is Hotep, okay. and this is D, it means give. But the letters are transposed because of that honorific business we talked about, right? Okay. So it will be written like that. Uh, well, you write it Hotep, then Nisu. Although it's Nisu D. Uh, uh, Nisu Hotep D. Take one of those markers and, and write it right <coughs> so we see exactly. This is the right. This is the way it should be written. Okay. Just write this under the end, there. But actually, really, the NSW <coughs> should it's be first. first. But we're honoring Hotep first, right? Because of the yeah, what you yeah, it should be. You know, that's yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. You see what I'm saying? Okay. Good deal. So we know we know the name of this formula. We know what's happening now. It's an offering that the king <coughs> gives. Who does it go to? <coughs> Asar. That's the next word. Or A S I R. This one right here. This is the second word here. And it goes under Asar, right there. The I and the C represents Asar. So I want to write my line to separate. I would write my third line down after. You can separate. Like just the way, the when you write old tip in the suit, just put it under here. Don't don't separate that because of that honorific thing. We don't don't want you confused. And if you want to separate this stuff out, the next thing to separate out are these two characters here. And it's uh, A S I R. And then the next character is N B. Why don't you mark that? Because that's still so washable. It'll wipe off the transparency. Well, let me see. Wall. Oh, it's almost right on the wall. I mean, on the wall. Because it'll wipe off. Then we can see whether we're trying to. I'm trying to write on y'all stuff here. When y'all. <laughs> <laughs> see, yeah, I'm, I'm just going because. Uh, you see, you want us to do it? You want? I want you to put it on your paper so you'll have it. You know. Oh, on the See, paper you're gonna, that he's yeah, writing you're gonna get a, Yeah, you're going to get oh. he's going to give me one of these. Just do it on the, on the sheet of paper that oh. when you copied it. That's what I'm trying to do, but then I can't get clearly where so, it's supposed to be. That's ooh. why I asked him to so work on that. The I is a sir. Uh, along with, with this chair. Because my, my words along are not chair. Yes. So I need him to clearly say which is which. So and and this, of course, is uh, another word by itself, Neb, which is Lord. Right here. Where? This oh, right here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's Ned. Mm -hmm. So that's part of that. What word. can you tell me about this word? That's the um. Huh? 
Jay Powell, what is this? The Jew. What is this right here? City. And it, what is it? Is it a, is it a uh, ideogram? Is it a determinative or what? It's a determinative. It's a determinative. determinative. It's a determinative. In this case, it's a determinative. Oh, okay. But why is it in the center of the word? To make it square. To follow it looks square. better. You see what's happening here? You know? Yes. Get used to this stuff because y'all will be seeing it over and over again. This is the good stuff. <coughs> We're going to go back over some of the stuff again. Don't worry about it. You know, we're going to go back. I, I'm gonna get, I want you to, 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 to get a feel for looking at real stater. This is an actual stater that comes out of the British Museum. You know. Okay, what do we have next here? This is Jeddu. You see it up there, the, the D with the line under it? The two Ds, the first one has a line under it. Right. And then the W. This is Netcher, N-T-R. And this is AA. Oh God, it's gone again. The AA that we're talking about is this one. We'll come back on in a minute. You want me to write the hieroglyphs over top of those? Tell me what to write. You were writing all day. I'll teach you for that. I can write kind of fast. Yeah, before you, yeah, you can do it. Go ahead, Steve. Nah, I just thought. Not my barn, Kenny. He gonna back out. I was trying to say, nah, brother, I'm looking at that door. There we go. Um, huh? Save by the, save by the overhead. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Okay. This is, uh, Lord again, Mab, NB, AB. This is AB, it's, it's a um, biliteral. This is a phonetic complement. This is AB, phonetic complement. So if you don't write ABB, you just write AB. Ab, Jew. This is a, another um, uh, biliteral. Okay? That's a Jew? Yeah, Jew. Uh, Ab, Jew. What about, the, what about the bird? Isn't that the Jew too? Which bird? This bird here? Yes. Yeah. No, this is just a W. This is Ab, I mean, this is Jed, Jed. By itself, it's Jed. When you put the W on it, it becomes Jed Do. Oh. This is Ab. But this is Jew, Ab Do. That they call Abidos. This is what, what uh, uh, the people now call Abidos. That's been changed. And this is, the, the uh, again, the um, determinative. This time, it's at the end of the word. Because it fits well right up in tucks real nice up in there. <clears throat> okay? Are we together? Yeah. This symbol here is, uh, uh, you know, the house is PR, right? Remember uh, his house and we were doing all of that stuff? But this is uh, really PRT. And this is HRW. It's not Heru, it's Heru, it's the hard H. It's the H with the line under it. And it means voice. Okay? This is really a voice offering, or some people say invocation offerings. This symbol for this is bread is T. Now remember the loaf of bread that you drew before, the little oval at the top of the flat bottom, the T? This is another type of loaf. That's bread. This is beer. Beer is H N K T. Hink it. And this is the head of a cow. Are, are you still with me? Right here. That's that's the cow. K A. Put, put, put behind that uh, um, a, a W in parentheses. Kau. <coughs> and this is foul. A P D. A pedu. A ped. This symbol here is the symbol for alabaster. S S. Make sure that I. Spell it right. 
little truth. Yes, alabaster. Where, 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 where? Huh? This is Huh? This is a different one. This is the same one. There's no symbols under this name. Yeah, that's because he's, he's sitting around three different things. No, but it's a different picture. He's sitting around three different Take things. One and pass one, please. This is a different picture. Yeah. Oh, we got here. Yeah. Oh, the different one's coming. Oh. Take one and pass the rest down. Yeah, we got the camera. Remember that? When you okay. was in school? Patient. Yeah. Take one and pass the rest down. You should have three different ones. These are your original. Here you go. Here's the third one. Huh? Look here goes some extras. John. John. I got extras. Who <laughs> You want a bat? I'm gonna give me an extra. Oh, man. I got this one. I got this one. I got this one. How we doing? <coughs> if you have extras, get, get a couple extras so you can practice with them all. Yeah. Hmm. Or just, you know, do one and, and walk up to somebody with, with, with a blank one, you know, and say, yeah, now nah, I think I'll decipher this thing. <laughs> he won't know. He won't know. You know. He never so, knows. You can tell him, says, look, I'll make sure you have access uh, to this Taylor. You know, when you see this, when you go to British Museum, come on this thing. Oh, oh you done that one before, yeah, huh? British Museum, the uh, <laughs> hey, Taylor number uh, <laughs> 587 on the... Uh, uh, in uh, uh, 8A, the room there, and uh, <laughs> when you go there, just you pick them up. Tell the book I sent you. <laughs> yeah. That's a good yeah. line. Uh, That's yeah. a good line, boy. <laughs> Can't go wrong with that one. All right, how are we doing here? Mm -hmm. Why is oh, Tony yeah. mess it up? <laughs> <laughs> All right, now. Uh, we got uh, it was alabaster, right? Then uh, S S. Okay. Then M N H with the line under it, the, the diacritical under it, and T for this symbol here. Which one? The I? Huh? The I looking one? This one with uh, the black line. Uh, the line up. Yeah. 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 So oh, those are the arrows of neat, aren't they? Huh? Aren't those the arrows of neat? I don't know for sure. I don't. I uh, I have to look. It's, it's in the it's in the sign list, but I, I don't. Uh, okay. Now. Uh, da, 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 da. Right here is a word itself. K. I mean H T. The H with the diacritical under and the T. Usually, you see that word written like this. You've seen it before. But I don't know if you probably didn't pay too much attention to it at the time. Yeah, it means thing or things. Yeah, thing. All right, since that means thing, and sometimes this lead doesn't mean Lord. It means each, every, and all. In this case, it means every. NB means every. So what do we have? Thing, every, everything. Everything. Uh-huh. 
Everything what? Good. Nefer means good. Or sometimes uh, um, beautiful. Or, you know, but it, words like that. Either good or beautiful. Okay, but you say that's a triliteral. And yeah, let me give you, I'm going to give you the... Uh, it doesn't uh, have the compliment stuff. Uh, 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 all the time, that, you know, you're not going to get it when you get to this level. You're not going to get compliments. See, they're saving space on here, man. You like to the right on here, you know? So okay. they just use the triliteral without the compliment. So you have NFR. In parenthesis, put T. Right under this symbol here. Right here under the next one, W-A-B. Over there, huh? Where we at? Right here, under the uh, this symbol, W-A-B. Yeah, the, the, the foot and leg, over it is a jug, and there's water being poured out of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What symbol is that? W-A-B, Wab. It means pure or clean. Now, if you if you took this same symbol right here and drew a man behind it, a seated man, it would not be uh, pure anymore. It would mean priest, a, a wab priest. That's Wabu one priest. of the base base. Huh? Wabu priest. It's a wab. Just W A B wab priest. The foot. The foot with the uh, oh. water jar over it. With, you know, pouring the water over it. Sometimes you just see the priest there with the water with the water jar over his head pouring down it. And that's also why I'm a priest. One of the worst forms of priest. And then after the that you have Ankh, A-N-H, and you have a T there. Then you have Netcher, N-T-R, and I-M. And here's your famous N ka N. N hyphen ka hyphen N. Why can't we see the face of the owl on this one? Huh? Why can't we see the face of the owl on this one? This, this just not drawn in. You're talking about the, the, the line and yeah. it's just not drawn in. What's NTR? N Nature. 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 Which God. one is that? The flag. Yeah, right here. Is it those two? Huh? Just right, just, 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 just right here. Just this the flag. Like, yeah. Uh, the, the, uh, the, uh, the feather is I am. I am. Uh -huh. That's the feather in the owls. I, I am. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And to complete the line, you have in cotton. Mm -hmm. How we doing? Two Hmm. Long feather. No, really, uh, uh, you know. See what happens with you. I was, okay, I wrote it out. I wrote it out like this. Mm -hmm. But you see, it's not matching up, so that's throwing me off. Oh, okay. okay. Uh, let me see where you are. I thought that was long. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I was trying to do it like that. Oh, I see. I see. Do you have that? Do you have yours under? No, but I just put a line so I can kind of know where I am as far as Okay. Yeah. It was a little more beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to have a lot of practice too. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you got plenty of stuff to do, bro. Believe me. Along with those sentences, and, you know, that's a lot. Um, right here, you have uh, I am A H. Are we together? Yeah. I'm going to do that. Okay, I am A H. R hyphen, I mean, uh, M hyphen R. M R. Then you have A, H with a line under it, N, W, in parenthesis, T, Y. And that's this, from here, from this A here, 
over the year. And you separate it at, at the uh, reed leaf. So that's not a feather. That is a. Uh, this is a reed leaf. So it's not like the feather. It's not like. Not the feather knot, no. That's C H N W all the way to the uh, leaf. A H A H N W T Y. All the way over to the uh, reed leaf, yeah. Come back to you. Huh? Not including it. Not including it. Really. Okay. 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 Which one represents which? Just for you know, just to know which picture, uh, which uh, natural uh, represents the uh, T Y. Which? Oh, no, that's in parentheses. I'll explain that to you oh, okay. in a minute. Yeah, that's what, in is, what is that the first uh, word? The first word, the I M A H. What is that object? Right up there. Uh, the part of a, I think it's part of the backbone or something. Uh, I have to look at it, and I'm, I'll look it up. I'll look it up before we go because the brother Lars uses um, sign list. Oh. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a backbone. Imiak. It means the revered one. Uh, and then you have I, M, N, Amen. Amen, I, M, N. Then you have M, and this is hot, H, A, T. That I, M, N. Uh, Amen. That picture, is that anything? Is that a, a man or just something? It like this, so it's, it's a game board. It's a game board. A game board. Board? Game board. Like, you know, you... Yeah, yeah. Like yeah. 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 Uh, it's a game board. Yes, and they usually play Senate, a game called Senate on it. Oh. Yeah. I'm in M. Hot. And this is my hero, true of voice. All right, now... If you look, I think on the inside. You gonna tell me five one next season? <laughs> uh, on the inside cover of that book, in this shirt here, the picture of the king. His name is Amenemhat. It means Amen is foremost. Or Amen is first. You see it in the Shinobi, you see? Amen in the hat. What page? Uh, the bottom of the cover at the beginning. Uh, yeah. that's, that's the man's name, Amen in hat. So let's figure out what this stuff means. A sacrifice that the king <coughs> gives. We know that. Hotep in his suit. Two. I see it. Lord of Jeddu. The great God. Lord of Abdu. That he might give a voice offering. Of bread. Beer. Cattle. Fowl. Alabaster. And linen. I think the guys are oh, hold on, maybe here until it comes back on. Oh, oh. I think the guys rejected your offer. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> maybe I just ain't my hair room. <laughs> uh, st I stopped with linen, or did I? Where did yeah. I stop? Huh? Yeah, the best. Can you read it? Start all again. again. Hmm. I'll read the whole translation, okay? <clears throat> A sacrifice that the king gives to Asar. You're reading from number one now, right? Or number two. I'm just reading the whole translation of the whole. Oh, okay. mm -hmm. Lord of Jeddu, great God of great nature, Lord of Abdu, an offering which comes forth a divorce to a voice offering, okay? Of bread, beer, oxen, fowl. Alabaster, linen, 
and everything good and pure <clears throat> on which a nature needs to live. For the Ka of the revered one, the overseer of the chamber, Amenemhat, true of voice. And down on his hand, you know, you saw this thing and uh, the, the symbols and it, and it just pointed out the fact that these are the required offerings there. Now what I'd like for you to do is look at the next, uh, <coughs> look at the next uh, stela. Wait a minute, let me get it. Uh, this one. <coughs> look at this one. 585. And somebody read the top line. <laughs> really? I uh, mm -hmm. a gift. A gift? Yep. To the god Osar. Oh, that's the same thing. Uh, City. You all know it. Look at your look at your old notes and look at this. I tell you what, I tell you what to do. Hold this one up, the one that you just got through doing. And then hold the, the, the uh, what was it, 585 up. And look at the top line. It's written, you know, the other way. Right. You read, instead of reading this, uh, instead of reading uh, from left to right, you read it from right to left. But you still have the same thing, the Hotep Dene De De Su formula, right? Yeah. An offering that the king gives to Asa. You have the same thing. Lord of Jeddu, mm -hmm. the great God, Lord of Abdu. And then rather than uh, the gift sign, you see it has a hand. You see what I do? Remember the one that I drew up here? Yeah. Uh -huh. he that he might give, or give he. You see, give he. Now, that's when the, the, the thing changes. Now they get very specific. That <laughs> sign behind it means a thousand and that's in the book where the numbers are in my book where the numbers are a thousand and the second line you go down a thousand and that M means of bread beer uh, cattle fowl alabaster and incense everything good and pure on which a God lives for the car of and then you have again the person's name you see how close they are. If you pick up the other one, get the other one, the film 43. Look at that top line. Hotep Denisu, offering that the king gives <coughs> to Asa, Lord of Jeddu, great God, Lord of Abdu, that he might give a voice offering, the offering which come forth of the, of, from the voice of cattle, fowl, alabaster, um, linen, everything good and pure that a God needs to live on. You see what I'm saying? This is a standard formula. The only thing you have to do then is begin to recognize the name of the person that gets it. But half of the formula, you know, you, can, you should just be able to read this without any problem. One day. Hmm? No, you you get it. I'm, I'm really right now. We've been going all day, you know. Uh, and had we uh, made this a, a, a just a special lesson, the way I usually do it, you know, because we, we don't have the time. If this was just a special lesson, we would have been working on this this morning. And when you all came back this evening, you know, uh, we would have had more time just to, to deal with it. We're, this is just an overview here. But I just wanted you to see, you know, that you can have access to a lot of stuff that's in these different museums. You can read a lot of stuff because there are specific formulas and methods that you use. All you got to do is figure out which one of the methods you're going to pull out and use. Y'all okay. got me y'all tired now. <laughs> Don't be doing going back to Merlin. <laughs> okay. Yeah. It would be possible to see that, that quick translation. Mm -hmm. Let me write that quick translation down. Sure. Yeah, I might match up with this. Yeah, there it is right there. It's right there. Man, you had a nerve to laugh in my handwriting. No. <laughs> 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 he said, no, 
me side with the other dude left in my stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Lord of Lord of Uh, it doesn't matter. I'm fine with it. Okay. Oh, why are you doing that? No, uh, I'm going to save I'm gonna save the rest of it for you all. I'm not going to give you any answers to the rest of it. No, I'm going to give you all of the answers for all of the other stale, but No, we need to work on it. Yeah, that'll, that'll kind of have, support it for you. Yeah, kind of work on others. They're not that much different, you know. Right. But it's gonna, it'll be, I'll, I'll, I'll do it with you. You know, you really need a dictionary to do this. And we haven't had time, I haven't had time to show you how to use the dictionary, how to use a sign this. You know, that, uh, I mean, for the next lecture. Yeah, we have to do that. But you did give us a, um, a step of one, yeah. Hmm? The R-O-Fall from Nobody. Nobody. Too no, too expensive. We'll buy any right now. We'll buy any right now. We'll deal with your book. We'll deal with your book. Uh, yeah, uh, you're not going to be able to decipher with my book. Don't worry about it. Uh, I'm going to make arrangements for you here on it. Have some dictionary. We'll, we'll be able to find some dictionaries. Yeah. Yeah, you'll be able to find dictionaries. Yeah, you know, you'll be able to find them cheap. You, know, you buy a new dictionary, it's too doggone high. You know, but really, sometimes you could go to like uh, used uh, bookstores. Used bookstores, and you know, you, you'd have to pick up one for a little nothing. Budget's you know. cheap though. It's like about ten dollars yeah. though. You can get budget, man, but like right now, don't don't. Cause I know I don't what. Use this 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 IPA here. I understand that, but I mean, it's cheap though. Yeah. It's only yeah. ten dollars. <laughs> well, if you, I mean, I, if you get, if you want to pick up one, I I got one. I'm I'm not gonna you know say anything about budget, but. Uh, I wouldn't suggest using it right at this point, you know, because there's a slight variation. We don't want to throw too much stuff in it. I've thrown too much at you already, but um, you all handled it kind of well, so I don't hey, feel bad about it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can I have action with some of this? I am looking at the book for all kinds of time. So you're a member of that uh, that second organization, right? The one you mentioned. Yeah, really. This mostly shipping. It takes you on a tour worldwide of the mind of the various uh, temples and holy places, centers, pyramids. <laughs> So you want to do something? Hey, Daddy. Yeah. I need to go to the restaurant. Can you do the text? Do I want to read them? I said, yeah, that's it. You want to give it to those types. That's what you're that's what that is all about. Well, I was just inquiring about your presence. So just send it this to me. Yeah, you know, that's going to be definitely a part of it. Yeah. They got they got both of them. You still want to sit there. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Well, yeah. Do you remember what I said? 
I was the PPD then. I was one of them. Man. Uh, uh, and this is line two, Bob. Mm -hmm. This is line two. This is line two. Now. No, not at all. You made a highlight. Okay, uh, now you got time to get back to me. I would like to get some feedback of uh, how you would uh, what do you want me to do when I come back. Oh, I can do it, you know, uh, if it's something that, you know, you have, the shit, I appreciate it. I, 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 I don't know if this is too far, you know, what I'm about to say, but I wanted to know if uh, next time you come, mm, if you could touch on the cursive. Yeah. And sure. Excuse me, show us how to, you know, how to uh, move from before, there. Before you do, do for real cursing, let's do, um, it's, 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 it's a form of, uh, a form of cursing. Okay, let's do that. Can I take this out? Because, you know, you have to learn that because I'll show you why. Can I do that? Yes. What do you mean? Most of that is just a problem. Make a couple of them. Right to left. And uh, when they do the T is like that, it's not a box, it's not a square. Mm -hmm. And the L is like not giving birth? No, no, no. Well, you know, I mean, they, they, they draw it out a, a lot different, you know. The uh, A, now that's the R, but that's the A. You can really differentiate between the head, you know. <coughs> That's this A. And when they do the end, then, then, then sometimes, you know, like that. Uh, oh, yes, we did. So, I mean, it's not as defined as you, you, you know, you're used to seeing it. Sometimes it's real close together. It might be sort of difficult to make out. But I will go over all of the mobile literals in here when, we, when I come back the next time. All right. Okay. What do you say when you learn from the back? Oh, yeah, and the, um, the K, like that. You know, so, <laughs> rather than a nice we'll looking, uh, So we'll get to, yeah. we'll get to that later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I don't know, it, it would depend on, it's going to depend on, I guess, Ty said it, you know, when, uh, when they decide, you know. Probably make the arrangements because they're going to be coordinating everything. Yeah. And uh, I'm their slave now. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, but yeah, it, it depends. You know, I guess when the arrangements can be made and the best time for everybody. But uh, you all got enough to kind of go over. Make sure you you do your your cards. Right. You charge your, yeah, for your mono literals, work on your uh, the, the uh, pronouns. You know, work on your pronouns. That I gave you a uh, a diagram of the suffix pronoun. You know, like uh, I, you, you know, he, she, it, blah, blah, blah. You know, and then the the passive form, and you know, the whole thing. Look at all of that good stuff. You know. Read those first, what's it, I said page one, one through 70, 71, 71, 71, yeah. 
Okay, which is part one. Yeah, part one. Read part one. And uh, kind of go back over in your mind some of the things that we did. And that stuff in the book will become, uh, uh, make a little more sense. Do you have an email address? Yeah, Giza. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Yes, okay, yes, sir. Robert, that I had said to um, Brother Giovanni earlier was that because I, I feel like a lot of people wanted to be here and couldn't be here this weekend, mm -hmm. that maybe next time um, you would start and bring them up to speed with where we ended up yesterday and then we would just kind of pick up what we like a review for us and then okay. we get to the point where we would have uh, our translations done so we get into well, the next Okay, let me, uh, okay. let me get it. Well, probably what that would mean is that maybe we should start on a Friday night for brand new people yeah. and then continue review on Saturday morning or something like that. So that's a very What you can do is make a packet. Wait a minute, hold on. Let me, let, 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 let me, let me, uh, so let me, let me, let me deal with her. So you're saying to uh, begin with the new people on Friday night. And then maybe make it so that Friday Evening and half day on Saturday is for the new people. Uh -huh. And then we would separate in Saturday afternoon and Sunday. Because that would give some reinforcement too to what you've already talked about. Get up to where. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we would be growing a little bit too. No, 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 no. You know, because by that time we would have covered this information and have questions and our translations and translators. And get y'all time to show off. That would make you look good because they will say, look what he talked then. Yeah, right. Uh, um, <laughs> exactly. Now, let me, let me throw something out to you. Let me throw something out to you. I might do Friday with the new folks, and you all be expecting them to be where you all were. No, well, sure it might not happen. Not. We'll, we'll no, I'm saying that, you know, <laughs> and then y'all going to be sitting back here sucking your teeth. Well, wait a minute. Why you didn't learn that? You, you know what I mean? No, I'm just teasing. No, but I'm just saying that, you know, people learn at different True. levels. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, that, I, yeah, okay, what I'll do is um, um, when I work with um, my city, we'll see if we can uh, set up some time with new people. But with the idea that if you all just want to come and sit in, it'd be yeah. fine. That, that would be fine. And plus, sometimes you know, one thing, you might you said it was a joke, but you know the best way to learn this stuff is to teach it. Because when you get up in front of somebody, boy, <laughs> and you try to teach it, and you don't know it, you know, you better make sure you, you got your stuff together because Questions will come from everywhere, and the best answer you got is, I don't know. <laughs> well, I will look that up. You know. But, uh, yeah, I, I would suggest, yeah, sure, come on in and, uh, you know, participate. Yeah, bro? Oh, I had a question. Do uh, you, have, you have any information on your correspondence course? Yeah, you mentioned that. Yeah, um, I have a correspondence course. <laughs> I'm trying to... I want to make a, just a couple of changes in that, you know, but it's ready to go. I mean, it's ready to go. It's 10 weeks. Um, the way it works, uh, there are, like I say, 10 lessons, not 10 weeks, there are 10 lessons. And it works out to be uh, $20 per lesson. Uh, one thing about it, I, I don't print them all up at the same time because I'm constantly trying to upgrade the, the course into, you know, it's a, it's a course and you just don't want to make them a book or something like that and print a whole lot of stuff and you find that it's not working and you have to throw all that stuff away, you know, because there is an ev evaluation form in, in the uh, course and I take it seriously because I do make changes according to, you know, what people say. Well, wait a minute, this is not working and blah, blah, blah. If I get enough people are not uh, 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 completing a specific assignment, something is wrong with the assignment. You know, uh, so I, I change it, you know, to try to find out ways I can get the information across. So uh, I have to print these things up, and then uh, uh, I print them as you request them. And you send the lesson in, I grade it, and I send it back to you. I ask you not to do the next lesson until you get this one back. 
And then I do ask that you make the corrections, you know, that, that, that I've suggested on there, you know. And after that, then you send the next lesson and we go back and forth just like that until you finish. If there's a question, I'm available, you can call and say, hey, aunt, this doesn't make any sense, you know. And uh, what we do is try to straighten it out over the phone or over the email or whatever, you know. Well, if you get for instance, a couple of those symbols that are difficult to draw, would you okay if you trace them? No, draw them. I really don't care. I'd rather see one of your birds look like a tree than, than for you to buy. I swear to God, I would. You know, you know I'm going to tell you why. You know, they got people out here who sell cards. You know, that you can buy flash cards. And uh, anybody that teaches Medinetra knows that's the worst thing you can do to a student, sell them a pre-made card. Because it, it, they'll never, you know, they'll never have the confidence to draw the things. You know, uh, Drawing it, that's not, that's not, it's important, but it's not that important. What's important is that you learn the language. <clears throat> Usually, uh, unless, I mean, it's got to be so really bad for me not to be able to understand what, what you've drawn. I, I, drawing, drawing is fine. You know, you could be the person that draws really well, but don't even know what the heck you've drawn. You know. So it's best, to, you know, to get the concept. Am I, did I, am I rambling or am I making any sense? No, you make sense. Okay. Make sense. Yeah, but don't buy cards, don't trace, just just do it, you know. If it looks like crap, then it looks like crap, but uh, you, you you know what the heck it means. That's the main thing. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you have to be able to, other people need to know Yeah, they, 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 you'll get to the point where, you know, I can show you some stuff. Uh, when you go to Cairo Museum, you're going to see some stuff. You say, what in the heck is this? I mean, it looks terrible. Really, I'm serious, you know. Don't worry about it. Uh, I mean, uh, 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 well, was are we there? Let's see, let's clear up what you're talking about. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I, I'm trying to understand what you mean by not what you mean, what exactly would be the material from. I mean, the characters are poorly done. That, that have been preserved from thousands yeah. of years? Oh. Yeah, I'm talking, they really, really look bad. You had some uh, writing scri scribes back then. You know. Like you got now. So yeah. Right yeah, see, that's, that's the thing about, about about people now. You know, we look back and say, oh, our ancestors were great. Now. Well, sure they were. But you had some lousy people back then, too. You know, some scribes who were, you know, just lazy, slovenly. They made a lot of mistakes, you know. But what folks fail to realize is those people were human beings just like us. No better, no worse. They were just in a better position. We're just at the bottom of things right now. It's going to change. No. It's going to change. And what you said, the time frame, the history, of course, huh? no, the, the, the time and history that this. This writing? Yeah. We don't know how low, how far it goes back. They say 32, uh, 3,200 years B.C., and some say 34 B.C. I, I, I just can't accept that. You know, they said uh, Kemet, uh, uh, what, 32 B.C. When, when it started. They say that the horror market is, well, after how many years old? I forget, you know. But I, I, can't, I just don't accept those dates. You know. what, 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 what date would you accept? I don't know, uh, I really don't know how old it is, but I know doggone well it's not no uh, 32. Uh, it's older than that. It's doggone right, yeah. They say it's car free. The face doesn't look like car free, not who am I? Yeah. yeah. Quasi did analysis of car face and uh, and the Sphinx face with lines, and it, they didn't come out the same. You can see them, he showed it on his That video. was done by a forensic uh, Technician, I think John Anthony West was the one that uh, commissioned that work. That's been done. Yeah, he, he he looked at his face and examined the face, and, and he looked at Car Frey's face, and it, it just it's impossible for for that to be for been Car Frey. Yeah, John, have you ever been here? No. Yeah, because I, I I got his books up in the sky, and I hear that uh, he's he uh, have like two classes. He's a topic. Yeah, the kind that wants to keep the situation that, that it is now, instead of Egypt, you got to go that controversial like John the West. And you suggest basically the same thing you're saying. 
you know, that's information that they have, but they don't want to share share with you. Yeah, yeah, you know, uh, um, I think they were talking about uh, doing some DNA studies or something on the, uh, uh, I think, mummies or something of the 18th dynasty, and then they called a the halt to it right away. Yeah. The reason they didn't want to do it is they would have to re rewrite history. So they said, we're not going to do this. So there's a lot of the stuff that they have, have done, it's just, it's not panning out. I'm not going to say that people uh, <coughs> purposefully falsified it. Some of it they might have, but a lot of times people will make mistakes, you know. You got to take that into consideration. But like, like I said, I don't care whether they falsified it or whether they purposefully done it. It's not going to stop me. I do my stuff. So you got the uh, Dylan Henry Clark? Oh, yeah. One of the most brilliant men I've ever met in my life. He spoke down there. Actually, my son has a picture of him. He got a prize in the shrine. They had a black holocaust on the conference. He's been to my house and had dinner there. I got pictures of him there he, uh, with my, my son, my son, my daughter in law. One of my sons was, was working on something. He did a, like a presentation down in my basement, you know. Mm -hmm. It was great, yeah. What have you come across um, Still about, uh, you know, the chefs and the Great Pyramid, but so you could go to a Ryan's Bell or go to your comments and see you like uh, no, I, I don't know anything about. It. I, uh, I've, I've heard about it, you know, but I personally, no, I don't. I Excuse don't have me. any knowledge. Yeah. <laughs> have I been in it? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, I've been in the Great Pyramid. Did you see the chefs on the side? Uh, no, we went into what they call the King's Chamber. In fact, uh, uh, Brother Banjoko, we were together when we we went in there. Yeah. Brother Dugan Khan that lives here together, yeah. I've been inside of the uh, Step Pyramid, the Pyramid of Unas, you know. Uh, most of the tombs and temples over there. Like, what is the atmosphere like? like huh? What is the atmosphere like when you walk into these steps? Like, there's spirits still there? Or something like that? I mean, not, I didn't. You know, feel in it, you know. I mean, those things have been trotted on and, you know, walked through, and desecrated for so many years. People scribble graffiti in it, you know. Even the, the sacred places over there, people disrespect stuff. I mean, they, oh, well, why should they worry about it, you know? It's not their culture. And we haven't done anything to preserve it. We don't have the, we don't have the skills to. We don't have... We don't have enough people uh, that are trained to, to uh, even decipher a lot of that stuff. Or, you know, we haven't done any epigraphic surveys where, you know, you just go, we don't have the money to do that kind of stuff. You know, we've got artists and, and stuff that can sit and, you know, uh, redraw a lot of that stuff. Line art, I have a lot of line art that's been done, you know. But it takes money to do that stuff. And it takes skills. You know, uh, I'm not saying that we don't have skills as a people, but uh, it seems we can do every doggone thing and play a lot of silly games and everything, but stuff that we say that mean a lot to us, you know, just don't do anything. To, you know. We let it fall, wait for somebody else to do it, and then we cry the blues talking about somebody's hiding something from us. Ain't <laughs> nobody hiding nothing from us. It's there. If we go there and... Um, and take the time to document the stuff. You know, bring back pictures. I would suggest bring back good pictures, you know, good photographs. They have what people say, take our photographs and then and, 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 and translate the stuff out of stuff. You got the skill. Yeah, brother. Oh, what happened to the original? Huh? What happened to the original? I don't know. Um, <laughs> you know, I, I, I guess with the invasions and... Um, it's just like what happened to the original Indians in this country, you know, they all but they dispersed and dead. It's like um, 
uh, Obinga said that he, he said a heck of a statement is to be or not to be. That is the question. <laughs> if you are and you're an Indian, you're dead or in the museum. If you are and you're black, you're a slave. Think about that. Huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, he had dispersed throughout the continent in there, but I mean, yeah, no, it's, it, huh? You know, which was the last question. The one there in power, not where did they come from? Asia. Asia? Yeah, there have been so many invasions there. You've got to remember, uh, the Asians invaded uh, long ago. And then the Arabs came in um, uh, and took most of all of North Africa and a lot of East Africa. The British were there, the French were there, Italians were there, you know. And we, you know, you got to realize, we're talking a, a lot of time, you know, and a lot of killing and, uh, uh, you know. Uh, yeah, you know, so I mean, I don't know. <laughs> A lot of people say, "Oh, you know, there's a, uh, a, a tribe of so and so and so." I don't, I don't know. I <coughs>